I'm looking at my Microsoft Clarity dashboard for Dynamics and in popular pages, I'm pretty interested in this very specific page for dynamic sales. So I go into the recordings of this page. There's a bunch of recordings, 68 of them all together for this page. And what I really want to do is get a summary of what's going on in these pages. Now, some of these pages have lots of clicks, like 23. Some have none, even though the duration is pretty long. And I don't want to, I want to exclude the zero clicks ones. So I'll go into filters and in here, user actions, there's a field here where I can say, just show me, here we go, page click count, how about that? Five or maybe even 10, let's do that. 10 page click counts, apply. So here it is. Let's see how many recordings we get. Okay, so we got a bunch of recordings here still with lots of clicks, 67, 73, 77. Now what I want is a summary of all of these recordings. What really happened in these? Because I'm not gonna go watch every single one of them. I mean, I could watch them, but it would take me a long time to watch every single one to see exactly what happened, where my users struggled and everything, right? So let me go ahead and actually, instead of watching it like this, generate a summary. Let me pause this. In this area right up top, it's got the summarize recordings. I'm gonna go ahead and click on that. I can just say summarize top 10 recordings, which would be the easiest, or I can do a custom select. So in this case, I can say this one, this one, maybe this one, I'm just selecting in random right now. But you can set, select as many as you want and then go ahead and generate uh, the recording summaries. So I just did three. Let's click on generate and see what happens. It's gonna give me session insights. Like it says, mistakes are possible. It is powered by AI, by Copilot inside Microsoft Clarity. And it's a really nice breakdown to successful achievements, successfully completed a guide task on how to resolve a case, wonderful. Unsuccessful, user failed to load the case details page, multiple JavaScript errors, that's not good. That's something we need to look at. And the good thing is when you click on it, it's actually gonna show you that information. I'll do that in a minute. And then some key takeaways. Okay, exactly what you can do, remove of course and fix JavaScript errors. Uh, you know, increase user engagement by doing these things and so forth. So excellent stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and click on this one, see where this happened. And this is the really cool stuff. If I click on this, it's gonna take me to exactly where it happened. And here's the red point, which shows that right there on this interface somewhere where the JavaScript error happened. Now I can play around with this more, but I'm gonna stop here and just say that this is how you can uh, see exactly what's happening in your Dynamics environment with AI summaries of recordings.